this video lesson is about adding and subtracting the similar fractions. The similar fractions are fractions having the different denominator. 5 over 10 and 9 over 8 are examples of the similar fractions because they have different denominator which is 10 and 8. So in this lesson, I'll show you the steps on adding on or subtracting the similar fractions. So first, find their LCD or the least common denominator. Two, change the dissimilar to similar fraction. Three, add or subtract the numerators. And copy the new denominator which is the LCD. And four, express the answer to lowest term if needed. So here my example number one. I have two over six plus one over three equals n. So we're going to find out what is the value of n. So let's try the steps on how to add or subtract the similar fractions. So first, find their LCD. Take note to get the LCD of the two fractions, multiply the two denominators. In my example, the two denominators are 6 and 3. So we're just going to multiply it. 6 times 3, it will give you an 18. So 18 is our LCD and our new denominator. So take note of that. And let's proceed to step 2 which is the change the dissimilar to similar fractions. So I have video uh, about on how to change dissimilar to similar fractions. So just click on the suggested uh, video above on this video on how to change the dissimilar to similar fractions. So take note, the LCD of 6 and 3 is 18. So our new denominator is 18. So 2 over 6, it's beca it become 6 over 18. While 1 over 3, it will become 6 over 18. So uh, if you notice, the first or the above or the top number, they, they have the different denominator while on the bottom part of the fractions they have the same denominator so we change it uh, we change the similar to similar fractions so let's proceed on step three which is add or subtract the numerators so and just copy the new denominators so we're just going to add the numerators which is six and six so 6 plus 6, it will give you a 12. And we're just going to copy the new denominator, which is 18. So our answer is 12 over 18. But 12 in 18 has the lowest term. So we're going to proceed on step 4, which is to express the answer to lowest term if needed. So in my example, uh, 12 and 18 have the lowest terms. So, in finding the lowest term again, I have a video on the suggested. Just click on that. And to find the lowest term, we just find their GCF for the greatest common factor. So, 12 and 18, their GCF is 6. So, we're just going to multiply. Or we're just going to divide 6. 12 by 6 and 18 by 6. So it will give you a 2 over 3. So 12 divided by 6, it will give you a 2. 18 di uh, divided by 3, it will give you a 3. So let's try an another example, which is number 2. And I have here 4 over 9 minus 1 over 3. So equals n. So again, we're just going to find out what is the value of n. So find their LCD or the least common denominator. So take note again, to get the LCD of the two fractions, 
multiply the two denominators and our denominators by this time is 9 and 3 so we're just going to multiply it 9 multiplied by 3 it will give you a 27 so the LCD of 9 and 3 is 27 and our new denominator is 27 so take note of that again so let's proceed to step 2 change the dissimilar to similar fractions so 4 over 9 and 1 third to become it to similar fraction we just have to put the new denominator denominator which is 27 so 4 over 9 it become 12 over 27 and 1 third it become 9 over 27 so if you notice again we change the similar to similar fractions so step 3 so add or subtract the numerators and just copy the new denominator which is 27 so 12 minus 9 it will give you a 3 and just copy the new denominator which is 27 so we have an answer of 3 over 27 so 3 and 27 have their gcf so we're just going to step 4 because it has a lowest term so express the answer to lowest term if needed so the D, the gcf of 3 and 27 is 3 so you're going to divide 3 divide by 3 it will give you a 1 and 27 divided by 3 it will give you a 9 so our new our new answer is 1 over 9 because we express the answer to lowest term so try this one so get your pencil and paper to try so i posted or par i posted the steps so you can follow on how to add or subtract the fractions so i have two examples there the addition and the subtraction so i'll give you a uh, enough time so you can answer both fractions so i'll give you a uh, 30 seconds your 30 seconds starts now Twenty seconds. Ten seconds. Five seconds. Time is up. So I'll show you my answer and just compare with your answer and if you don't get it right just uh, get some papers to uh, to answer more time to get that answer so i'll show you my answer and here is my answer 18 over 16 or 9 over 8 and 14 over 24 or 7 over 12 i have or because uh, they have uh, a lowest term so if you need a lowest term lowest term it okay so congrats you finished the lesson thank you